Hey everybody, welcome back for more of the Indigo Disc DLC. In the last episode we had a double battle against Carmen. Uh, check that out. Uh, we explored a little bit, caught a bunch more Pokemon, and uh, we met a few new characters. We saw Kieran, he's looking a little different. Uh, and here we are. Hey, are you sure this is a good idea? You know, because because of Kieran? Nah, don't worry, he won't show up here anytime soon. If you say so. Anyway, this is the base of operations for the League Club. On behalf of the whole club, glad you're here. Glad you asked. We Blueberry Academy students have our own Pokemon battle ranking system, the DB League. Here in the League Club, we battle each other to train up so we can climb the ranks. We win, we lose, we have a good old rowdy time. Such is our humble club in a nutshell. You're not wrong, but seriously, that's how you explain it to new people? Yep. Though I guess we're having less of a good old rowdy time than usual lately. I'm a member of the club too, I don't show up to club room very much though. Just FYI, the top four Pokemon trainers in the BB League are called the BB League Elite Four. And this is annoying toothpaste-haired bozo is one of them. So is that girl you saw with me at the terrarium earlier. Too bad you didn't make the cut, Carmen. <laughs> I've just been too busy with extracurricular stuff. Haven't had time for the league matches. If we're talking actual skill, I'm way above any of them. <laughs> sure you are. That's no lie. What you think, Mark? Fun club, huh? Oh, I can feel the enthusiasm. That's what I'm talking about. Anyway, I think that takes care of it. You're in on a trial basis. What do you mean, trial basis? You heard me. As far as the Dreister's concerned, we are clubmates now. Trial basis, clubmates. Now you can use this clubroom freely and do whatever with the stuff here. Check out the computer over there, too. It's super helpful. It lets you use your BP to support kids in other clubs. They'll return the favor in different ways. Okay. Don't need a BP to return. In return, you'll reap all kinds of rewards, such as new functions for your camera app and new ways to redecorate the club. Okay. Here, give it a shot and see what I'll. Do under B. Okay. Try sending that to Mitch in the baseball club. He can help you out with throwing form. God, my controller's moving on its own again. <laughs> Drawing new throwing styles want cool new ways to throw Pokeballs. Let's spit the ball together in return for your little contribution to our poke. Drawing new throwing styles will become... Ooh, okay, so we get new ways to throw Pokeballs. That's pretty cool. Thanks for the support, Mark. Wish we could do it in person, but let's try pitching some ideas for new ways to throw. See, I was thinking I could hold my hand like this, get me, then I swing my leg and... Yeah, <laughs> yeah you know what? I think that'll work. Talking through this with you really helped. We come up with a real home run here. If you ever want to change how you throw your Pokeballs, just give me another call. More throwing styles to choose from. Well, that's pretty cool. Change up a little bit. You did. Not bad for your first time. That'll teach me to doubt your skills. Here, I got a really nice present for you from one charming catch to another. <laughs> Ooh. I needed that. <laughs> and one of these unshakable charms makes it more likely you get a critical catch. Thank God. <laughs> you can add this too, put it on, and you'll look just like Draster. League Club Uniform. Anyway, feel free to... Uh, to computer it up any way you want. Like I said, we're trial basis clubmates now. And that's not all. For a limited time, you can have as many of these snacks as you want. Those snacks are all yours, Dryden. Snacks you leave around open and half. <laughs> I wouldn't go near any of them. Who knows how long they've been sitting around. All that explaining left me starving. I think I'm going to head on over to the cafeteria. If you want to officially join us, we can have a cafeteria day to talk details. Oh, what? 
be seeing ya. That bozo, seriously, what is his problem? <laughs> and a cafeteria date, what does he even mean by that? <laughs> he can explain a date. <laughs> That's fantastic. Just so you know, this is not excitement over the date thing, it's anger. <sighs> Sorry, being in here puts me on edge. Let's go somewhere else. Some place people won't bother us. I know. Let's go to your... Whoa! Moving a little fast there. <laughs> oh, God. More dorm room. It's gonna be empty, isn't it? Oh, it looks about the same as the room in the other place. Looks like this is your room. Most BB students live in the dorms, you know. So what do you think? How's it compared to the dorm? It's literally the same thing, only a different color scheme. <laughs> That's no fun. Well, you can come have a look at my room later, too, if you want. But I got distracted. There's something I need to tell you. It's about Drayton and, well, Kiki. Kiki is... Well, you saw how he is. He's scaring me nowadays. Ever since we got back from Kitakami, it's like he's become a totally different person. He's been battling and training every day. He's even cutting back on sleep. He's he's definitely gotten stronger. And Drayton used to be the strongest student here. But Kiki beat him. Now Kiki's the president of the league club and the BB League champion. I guess he must be pretty busy. He barely talks to me anymore. Oh, well... He's probably just going through a rebellious phase. Kieran's changed, but you... you stayed the same. If Kieran's down to just one friend these days, I'm glad it's you. Keeping... keep sticking with him, would you? Yeah. Thank you. There's one more thing I need to tell you about. <laughs> Don't trust that knucklehead. He might seem like a slacker. But don't let him fool you. He's up to something. He's a real annoying super jerk. He barely even goes to class. He's had to repeat the same year three times. <laughs> Point is, don't let your guard down around him, ever. You're going on a date. I mean, you're going to hang out with Drayton later, right? I'd go with, but if I don't finish up this report today, I'm really going to be in trouble. I'd love for you to join the league club. But if Drayton gives you any trouble, don't be afraid to give him a good sucker punch. Alright. So, is there anything I can... Wait. Can I change... What was that outfit thing that I got? League club uniform. Yeah, that's gonna be a new... Yeah. Yeah, not really... Not really into that one. <laughs> I thought I was gonna get a cool jacket or something. Okay, cafeteria, league club room. Let's go to the league club room, I guess. We'll get some of the school stuff out of the way, and then we'll... There he is. Hey, Mark. I don't need to stand there. Grab a seat. Here's the dresser's take. The academy specials. Uh, the best thing on the menu. It's all so soft, you can basically just gulp it down, barely even need the chew. <laughs> chew your fur trade. <laughs> you and my mom would get along. So listen, your Pokemon are pretty strong, yeah? With a team like that, you've got a shot at becoming the BB League champion. Wouldn't that be wild, an exchange student just rolling up here and snatching the crown? I want to see you join the BB League, Mark. You in? Sure, I'll... Look who's decided to grace us with their presence. Oh, it's the champion. And the rest of the Elite Four, too. What did you want to talk to me about? Nothing special. Just thought we could grab a bite. We're better to do that than the cafeteria. What a waste of time. If you've got so much time to goof off, why don't you go train your Pokemon? Think maybe this is why you always lose to me? 
I'll take that as a no. Oh, I can't swing a lunch date with you, even if I've got your old pal with me. But, Mark? Why? You didn't hear that he was coming to study abroad here? For real? Yes, it's true. Director Cyrano himself introduced him to me when we met at the school's entrance. We're already tight, us two. <laughs> In fact, I was just asking Mark to join the BD League. Oh, I like it. That'd be fire. I wonder what types he uses. A student from another school joining the BB League, unprecedented. That's right. Mark may be wonderfully capable in battle, but that doesn't mean he belongs in the BB League. Oh, come on. You all hate fun and friendship or something? You want to exclude someone who's taking our same classes and living in our same dorm rooms? How is he not one of us? Isn't this place supposed to be all about students having autonomy? I think we should vote on it. And I'm a yes, obviously. How about you, Lacey? I'm sorry, but considering the rules, it's a no from me. How about you, Crispin? Yeah, why not? That's two against one. It's at our school, that makes him a student like us, right? How about you? A Mary's? Uh, what do you say? I abide by the rules of the institution. Proposition decline. Oh. Two against two, huh? Alright then. What says the reigning BB League champion, our mighty Karen? Yeah. What about it, Karen? <laughs> Wanna battle me again? <laughs> it doesn't matter who I'm facing. I don't lose. Guess we've got our answer. Karen, wait. Drayton, manipulating people to get what you want, it's just not right. <laughs> Sorry, Mark. Guess you'll be joining the BB League, huh? Well, let's look on the bright side. Maybe you and Kieran will come out of this better friends. Don't worry, I'll be right behind you every step of the way. But now that the decision's been made, we better get you officially signed up. Maybe at the reception desk, the school's entrance area. Okay. Entrance. There you are. This is where we can get you signed up for the BB League. How can I help you today? Oh god, she got so serious. It says here that you're an exchange student, which means you're not technically enrolled here. At our academy. Oh, don't mind that. We Elite Four talked it over real quick. My friend here is good to join. I don't mean to sound rude, but I'm not sure if I can take what you say at face value, Dre. <laughs> no, he's telling the truth. I'm allowing Mark to join the BB League. Yes, champion, one moment, please. Didn't expect you to ride up in shining armor and save the day. Got a feeling you're trying to play Puppet Master. If I get a shot at battling Mark, then that's fine with me. That's just peachy. Mark. You better not go losing to anyone until our battle. <laughs> so tempted. Good. Oh jeez, that face. <laughs> I'm not a little kid anymore, and you'll know it when I show you how the best of the best battle. Kiki, you shouldn't talk to Mark like that. Shut it, sis. Looking forward to seeing you climb the ranks. I'm sorry, Mark. Kiki was really acting out, wasn't he? That was my first time talking to him in a while, too. Man, such an attitude. Well, he's Mr. Big Deal Mighty Champion, after all. Drayton, you're the one who dragged Mark into all this BB League drama, aren't you? Ain't no way. This was all his idea. 
Hey, man. That's the spirit. Feeling that human urge to do great things, right? I don't know. I think something fishy is going on. Well, if you're going to do this, you might as well do your best. I'll be cheering for you. And please, keep an eye on Kiki for me. Thank you for waiting. Your entry into the BB League is complete. Great timing. Mark is cleared to compete in the BB League. Usually, you'd start by battling regular students and climbing the ranks, but seeing as how you've got recommendations from several Elite Four members and Director Cyrano, you'll start from a higher rank. You'll skip straight to challenging the Elite Four at their respective bases in the terrarium once you clear their trials, that is. I'll go ahead and mark their locations in your Rotom phone now. I mean, they could have at least made us battle a bunch of trainers before doing that, just to make it last a little longer. Locations of each of the BB League Elite Four have been added to your map app. To challenge the Elite Four, you'll need BB, uh, which you can earn by doing BBQs. Then if you defeat all the members of the Elite Four, you can challenge the champion. Alright then, best of luck in the BB League. You can start with whichever of us you want your call. Oh, so I get to pick. Anytime you want to battle one of us, you'll have to do a fun little trial we cooked up first. Sounds good, right? Catch you in the terrarium, bud. Alright, use your map to find your next location. Um, common dorm. Let us go to the terrarium. Alright, let's go to the one area that I haven't really explored. And then we'll probably call it quits for tonight. And uh, I will do a bunch of off-screen stuff to, uh, I don't know, I'll just wander around and see if there are any Pokemon that I didn't catch on screen. And then we didn't really go this direction, so we'll see some stuff we didn't see before. Chansey, Rhyhorn, Execute, Still looking like the same stuff here. Okay, Max Revive, that's pretty cool. Endeavor! Sawsbuck. Double Edge. Pretty good if you got a Pokemon that, uh, that doesn't take damage from recoil. I like a rye horn line. Zipitor. It's looking like a lot of the same stuff. I thought that was a cave. <laughs> so what we'll probably do is I will uh I'll look around off-screen. Um, you know, who knows, maybe I'll catch a shiny uh, tonight or something. And then tomorrow, we will... Um, check out some of the Elite Four stuff and get started on that. Plus I should evolve some of the Pokemon that I've caught. There's a lot of stuff here. Alright, let's see if there's anything here. Canyon Biome. <gasps> here we go. Come here, I saw you. My friend! The first time I ever saw this Pokemon, I, uh, I down, I probably shouldn't say this out loud, I, I played an early version of Black and White, let's just put it that way. Who said download? Um, and there was like, a, a not good English patch, where some things were in English and some things weren't. Um, but it was, it was fun to be able to experience this game. 
first time I saw Scraggy, I caught it and it instantly became one of my favorites. It, it was a little tough to train at first, but uh, once I got a couple moves on it, that seemed to be really good. This one is normal. Moxie, huh? Okay, it's good for a long standing battle. Alright. Um, I don't know what else I could get here. So let's wander around a little bit. Let's also check the Pokedex, which is always a little handy to do. I saw Scizor on the map. What the heck? Hunter Volumes. I got an upgrade. And now a Dubious Disc. A Safari Ball. Ooh, Electrizer. Okay. That's what we're saving up for next. See, uh, see what else we got around here. Hmm. Ellie Kids here as well. Scyther. So if some of the Hisuian Pokemon are here, does that mean Cleaver is here somewhere? Because that would be cool. Wouldn't mind getting me a Cleaver. Without having to uh, transfer over one. There's some water here. There might be some different water Pokemon. The bridge. Interesting. Why do I feel like this has something to do with the trial? Ooh, a cave. Rotom. Oh god, is a bunch of Rotoms gonna spawn in this cave? Because that would be funny. Because <laughs> the caves in the last DLC would spawn, like, an insane amount of one Pokemon. They might have patched that. Or not. They don't seem to patch things. <laughs> An outbreak. <gasps> Wait! We're getting outbreaks now? Um, okay, Hasuian, not going to bother with that. Pentacool, and whatever this is. Probably an evolution of something from this biome. I don't see anything in this one, though. Hmm. Skarmory's here. He's on the map. Oh, Skarmory! Shield on! Cool. Um, that's not gonna do much damage. Shadow Claw, maybe? There's another Scar Rank here that messes up. Oh god. Skarmory is always known as, like, super annoying to catch, please. <laughs> of course, I picked this thing, this thing's gonna knock itself out. Okay, he recoils, so... It's probably not good to damage this thing. Damn it, it's gonna kill itself. Yep. Alright, round two. Well, there's a bunch around here, so... We can get a shield on. And, uh... We can attempt it again. This thing's a steel tech, right? Crap. Ow. And it died. <laughs> Let's try you. Dude, Skarmory looks so good. With the new texture. Oh, he did endure! Good boy. And I critted him too. Oh god. 
Now you can go in the Pokeball. I have the Catching Charm too, and it doesn't seem to be kicking in just yet. Alright, while we try to catch these Pokemon, I would like to thank everybody for watching today. If you guys enjoyed seeing some of the story, uh, leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe. Uh, in the next episode, which uh, I'll start recording probably tomorrow, uh, I'm going to check out some of the Elite Four stuff. I think we'll check out the Fire one first, and then uh, we'll go uh, upwards and around. Uh, send to the box. That's you. So I'm guessing that means um, Cranidos is probably in this too, right? So I just chuck Pokeballs at this and hope for the best. Because, I mean, it's going to Brave Bird itself. for a little bit, but if uh, if it doesn't seem to want to ever go into Pokeball, then we'll end things off and uh, maybe I'll, I'll have this in the next video. Ooh. Nope. <laughs> oh god. Come on, just do me a favor and give me a crit catch. No. Don't want to give to me. Huh? All right, we got it. All right, uh, I will see you guys in the next episode. If I find anything new, I won't catch it. I'll wait and catch it on screen, uh, so you guys can see where it is. Um, I'll just try to remember where those Pokemon are on screen. That is not very good. <laughs> of course not. Anyway, uh, I will see you guys in the next episode. Until then, take care, everybody. Do all the things that helps grow the channel. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.